Hello, good afternoon everyone. Welcome to my YouTube channel. Today um I'm going to show you how to install um loopback interface on Windows 10. Okay. Uh, my window I just uh, uh, have a fresh install. So I don't have any loopback adapter. Okay. So I will go to my adapter that uh, I have Wi-Fi I have cable I need to rename this is the uh, Ethernet cable okay and I have installed VMware workstation so I got these two uh, VMware adapters and I don't have any loopback adapter so how to install loopback adapter go to here right click on this PC go to manage and go to device manager click on network adapter go to action add legacy hardware next install hardware manually okay and go next click on network adapter because we want to install network adapter next just wait so click on Microsoft here Microsoft KM test loopback adapter in Windows 7 there will be uh, only Microsoft loopback adapter but Windows 8 and uh, Windows 10 this is a Microsoft KM test loopback adapter. So click on it and go next. Next to install the adapter. You can have uh, many adapters as you like. Okay. Um, here I have installed one adapter. So I say loopback one. I can install loopback adapter as many as I like okay so I go to add another one manually next go to network adapter and next click on Microsoft okay on test loopback adapter next next install yeah I need only two uh, loopback adapter so Sorry, um, need to rename this loopback adapter to yeah, loopback two. Okay, I have installed uh, two loopback adapters already, and next I will bridge my wireless network, my cable network, and my two loopback adapters to VMware okay to VMware software so how open VMware workstation because I'm uh, using VMware most of the time to install other windows or other operating systems and uh, other um, system the yeah, other uh, like uh, I will have um, PBH I will have um, GNS3 something like that so I need to add my loopback adapter to GNS3 setting so I go to edit virtual network editor there are only two VMnet1 and VMnet8 as you see in here VMnet1 and VMnet8 okay as a default adapter but we can install more okay go to change settings before we can add a new network um, we need to click on vmnet0 change from this vmnet0 from bridge to host only because I want to bridge um, other three 
four networks, three or four uh, VM net to my adapters here. So totally it's four. One, two, three, and four. Okay. So I add a new network, VM net two. I will bridge it to Wi-Fi. Okay. VM net two. I bridge to my wireless network. Where is my wireless network? Here. Broadcom 80.2 sorry 802.11 AC. Add one more VM net three. Then I bridge it to network table. Okay, Ethernet connection. VM net four, I will bridge to loopback one. Loopback one. Here is loopback one. VM net five, I will bridge it to loopback two. Okay. Loopback two. Yeah, that's it. Then we can apply. After we bridge the interfaces, uh, we can use it later. We can use uh, uh, this VM net 2, 3, 4, and 5 to link to your GNS3 VM to your uh, other virtual machines. Okay? And you can link to Wi Fi networks so that uh, your real network can connect to your virtual machine. Okay, then click OK. Yeah, we have done um, configuration on uh, installed loopback adapter and bridging those loopback adapters to VMware workstation. And if you have any other question, please let me know. Yeah, thank you for watching.